Residents at the St. James Terrace Senior Apartments in West Baltimore have reached their boiling point over the city's required boil water advisory. We don't have no water to even wash our tail with. They talking about boiling water? I'm not boiling no dirty water. I'm not doing that. That's feces in that water. That's crazy, man. Many of them telling us they remain fearful of using the water even if they take safety precautions. We can't wash ourselves, we can't clean our dishes, we can't cook, we can't drink the water. Wednesday at nearby Harlem Park Elementary, the only source for clean water in this part of the city, lines were long and so were frustrations. A lot of people in here don't have cars, so how they go get water? You know what I mean? They bring water, but they don't bring enough water. Senior residents also feel that they are being left out of the loop, receiving what they call mixed messages from the city, wondering when it will be safe to drink the water again. It's been really, man, it's been crazy, man. You know, nobody tells us anything. Everybody want to keep us in the dark, and it's not right. We shouldn't have to live like this. Now, we spoke with officials from the city health department. They tell us for seniors or folks that are homebound, they can call 311 to have water delivered to their homes, or if they can have a friend or a family member pick one up from a location like this one here at Harlem Park Elementary. But there is no doubt the senior and elderly community here in West Baltimore is getting very frustrated. We're live in Harlem Park tonight. I'm Lowell Melser, WBAL TV 11 News. All right, well, thank you. And you can stay with WBAL TV 11 on air and online for the latest on the E. coli contamination, the water distribution sites and any schools impacted. Just turn on those push alerts to get late breaking updates sent right to your phone.